Reflect on who you are and what career you want. Part 2. Explore the jobs and other career prospects open to you. These are notes for the Semester 2, 2021, Work Portfolio Package at the Australian National University, Computer Science Tech Launcher Program. In this third of four parts, you will prepare for the Work Portfolio Package WPP, assignment, an application for employment, promotion, internship, scholarship, award or other career-enhancing activity. Components of a job application. The cover letter introduces the applicant, you, explains why you want the position, and your most relevant qualifications, skills and experience. It should be prepared last, but placed first. The cover letter provides a summary of claims to the position. The cover letter should be followed by your statement addressing the selection criteria. This is followed by the curriculum vitae CV, also called a resume. The CV is an overview of a person's experience and qualifications. Supplementary material can be placed at the end of the application as evidence of work described in the application. This could be diagrams, samples of code, schematics of a prototype, user testing procedures, or other work. It is important that the work presented was created by you, not just a team you worked in. Reflective writing. Unlike the group work carried out for your project, the application cover letter, responses to selection criteria and a CV are individual. This work needs to be reflective, it is about how you can fit the role, how you have faced challenges and learned from them. Three reflective questions for any position are, can you do the job? Do you want to do the job? Do you fit into the culture? University of Technology Sydney use a model for teaching reflection, with four levels. Recount, what happened? React, how did you feel about what happened? Analyze, why it happened, or why you reacted as you did? Improve, what did you learn from what happened? What will you change to improve things? In preparing your cover letter you may choose to highlight something you have learned during your studies. This need not be something planned, or part of the formal curriculum. Four levels of reflection. Kajunda, Daniels, Peters and McDermott 2014, describe four levels of reflection. Descriptive writing, the student simply describes experience without significant attempts at analysis. Descriptive reflection, the student attempts to provide reasons for their learning experiences based upon quasi-reflective personal judgments. Dialogic reflection, the student enters into a personal discourse to explore possible reasons for observed outcomes. Critical reflection, elaboration of reasons for personal learning decisions and experiences. In your WPP you are expected to exhibit critical reflection. Suggested readings. Reflective writing, careers website and cover letters, and resumes, Australian National University, Careers Guide. Suggested activity. Explore careers core capability. 3. Find and secure work on the dashboard in the Careers Toolkit. Workshop and task. Please prepare for Workshop 3 and be ready to complete Task 3. For further information see Learning to Reflect on the Wattle System at the Australian National University website. To learn more about the educational approach behind the design, look for Reflective Portfolio Course at the Higher Education Whisperer blog.